All right, well, hello, my substitute teacher. I am so glad that you're taking this on and welcome to the craziness that is the Backstage Studios. Okay, so a couple things you need to know about um, is first of all, uh, you, you don't need to teach anything. Okay, right here behind you, you can see that. There's a website written on the wall here, mytech2s.com. The students know to go there. All the lessons are there. They're little, short little tutorials that they watch and that tells them how to build the robots. It tells them how to use the podcasting studio, how to animate, how to draw, how to sing in the studio. All of that is on mytech2s.com, okay? So really, you're on crowd control. You just got to uh, work the room, make sure everybody's okay, and usually uh, they'll be working out just fine. If something goes wrong, like where's that sewing machine? There it is. Okay, if something goes wrong, like suddenly the sewing machine doesn't work anymore or the mixers in the studio here, um, you know, there's a lot of little controls. Let me get that over my shoulder. See, there's just so many little knobs and controls in there. If, if something stops working, uh, don't worry. Just ask the student to work on a different project or different, we call them tech twos, okay? So that's that's really the essence of it. Um, below this video, I kind of have a step-by-step -step guide on how to set up the room at the beginning of the day. Basically, you're turning on the lights and your, the ACs and you're distributing the iPads from the charger. Actually, that's right over my shoulder. Uh, it's empty right now because all the, all the iPads are there you go, they're out on the tables. Uh, so that's what you do at the beginning of the day, so just follow this checklist, and at the end of the day, you kind of reverse it. You turn off the AC, you turn off the lights, take all the iPads and put them back uh, in the charging unit here so that they're all charged up for the next day. Uh, I am so grateful for you to be here to take care of my class while I'm away. I don't know if I'm sick at a conference, at an appointment, whatever, but I am very grateful that you're here. I hope everything works out. If I'm available through email, hopefully I am, you can always just shoot me an email. Uh, but basically, uh, if this, oh, and the students should be able to help each other out. So let's say a student's like, um, I, don't how, I don't know how to do this in animation. Now, chances are they maybe skipped watching one of the, the tutorial videos. So you just remind them, have you watched all the tutorial videos? And they probably will say, oh yeah, but just really remind them that other students have finished this. It's okay. It's probably answered in the tutorial videos on the website. If not, maybe they can ask around the room, hey, has anyone else done animation? I need a little help with this. How do I export it or something? And um, they should be able to get help from around the room. And if nothing else, if nothing works, they just need to stop and go working, start working on a different tech too. Okay. Uh, again, everything's just below this. And thank you uh, from the bottom of my heart for taking this on and I hope you have just as much fun as I have every day uh, with this amazing class. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.